sim races. Today we're going to be having another go with Assetto Corsa Competizione, taking a run around Monza in my favourite car here, the Ferrari 488 GT3. Monza is probably one of my favourite circuits, the fact that it's so focused on speed, very few slow areas on the circuit, so I definitely love it. We're going to take a quick look at the setup before we go into anything. So for this setup here, to do with the tires, tire pressures, toe camber, I grabbed all that stuff from either race department or another YouTube video somewhere. Um, we have for the electronics, the traction control is very important. I'm going to explain that as we're going around the lap. The ABS, I like to keep that set to two just to make sure that there's minimal interference from the car, but it still helps me to not lock up. Uh, fuel and strategy is not important. Mechanical grip, again, those settings I just grabbed from a random either video or a set of videos or a set of race department numbers and messed around a bit myself. Same for the dampers. The only thing that I really have to tell you is for the aero, for the brake ducts, what you could actually try doing is setting them to one and one or one and zero if you don't overheat your brakes too much. It can actually help to reduce a little bit of time and had I have realized it, I would have done it on this run. I just forgot to do it. Okay, so picking up the lap here, we're coming into Parabolica just about to start. Once we get to the end of the red and white curbs, hitting the gas as hard as possible with third gear and nailing it. Just trying to carry as much speed as possible along the start finish straight. Now at this point you want to start thinking about taking your traction control down to three um, for turns one and two, trying to brake at the 150 meter board, using a little trail braking, try and be as smooth as possible first and then second turn. Try and get the best possible exit. You can use the area to the right, but I tend to try to avoid it for wheel spin. Curva Grande, try and stick to the right hand side of the track. Try not to run on the curbs, but be close to them if possible. And then looking here for just after the 150 meter board, breaking down to second. You're trying to use the third setting for contra traction control here again. Get the best possible exit. Use a little curb on the left if you need to. Lesmo one. Third gear, try and hook it coming into the corner. I make a bit of a mistake there. So you want to be a bit neater going through there. And then with the second Lesmo, there's a bit of a dip right on the apex there. If you can hook that, it gives you a massive launch down the start finish straight. I mean, sorry, down the straight here. Um, and at this point, I want to be changing my traction control up to six to help me through a scary, Braking just after the bridge turning in you can ride the curb on the left and the right here trying to get full power touch the curb on the left and then go for it down a massive straight trying to take as much speed out of that corner as possible we're going to use the whole range of fifth gear up to six brake at the 100 meter board turn in third gear traction control settings here you can do anywhere from four to six and it's pretty good I find it variable so I'm gonna mess with that again just to see and then we're gonna come over the line with a 149.395 so that's my fastest time so far still working it down but using the traction control is definitely helping me to figure stuff out